Hi guys, it's Laura and you're watching Laura X Annie. Today I'm here with a sequel to Thursday's video and it is top five actresses. So same format as Thursday, five to one, favourite actress, what I love them in and honourable mentions. So in at number five is Eva Green. I loved her as Vesper in Casino Royale of the James Bond, the first of like the Daniel Craig James Bond films. I love Eva Green. I also loved her in Womb slash Clone with Matt Smith. I loved her in Cracks with Juno Temple and Imogen Poots. Oh, there's so many things Eva's been in. I have not seen Penny Dreadful yet. I really want to see it. I also, also loved Eva in uh, Dark Shadows. I do, I do love Eva. She is a really good actress. I love her. In at number four is Helena Bohm Carter and I loved her as Mrs Lovett in Sweeney Todd. I was a humongous fan of Sweeney Todd when it came out with Johnny Depp in it. Uh, as you can tell Johnny Depp has not been mentioned anywhere in this list. Anywhere in the other list sorry and he won't be mentioned after the huge debacle that's going on. Um, I love Helena Bohm Carter. I love her as a Red Queen in Alice in Wonderland. I love her um, in The Corpse Bride. I love her. Um, I just I just love her. She was in Fight Club as well, which I've not seen yet, but I can't wait to see. I just love Helena Bohm Carter. I really just, I really just love her so much. And at number three is Case Galadio, and I loved her as Karen in True Love. Now, True Love was a five-part series for BBC back in 2012. David Tennant was also in it, and um, it's basically a sort of mostly improvised thing and um, Case Glado played Karen and I love her, I just loved her and it. it was so deep and meaningful and it was just really really nice and then also Kia is well known for being Effie in Skins, uh, Effie is one of my favourite characters alongside Emily and Naomi and also Kia has been in the Maze Runner trilogy series thing I've not seen it yet, but I probably should. And congratulations to Kea, who is pregnant and yes, anyway. And at number two is Saran Jones, who played Sarah in Single Father. Now, she, uh, Single Father, I also mentioned this on Thursday's video, was a four episode series for the BBC and um, it was a drama back in 2010 and it starred David Tennant as well. And uh, Rupert Graves was also in it and it was basically about David Tennant's character lost his wife and it was having to deal with their three kids and um, one of the kids is adopted and it was just a lot of and Sarah um, played by Sir Anne Jones was like their their like basically bed, uh, not bed, David Tennant's character's uh, wife's like well not wife they weren't actually married partners like best pal and then they get together. It's really good but Sir Andrews was also in Dr Foster which was amazing and she's been in so much and she's amazing. Now on to some honourable mentions. Louise Bearley who I loved as Miss Julie in Miss Julie which I saw at the Citizens Theatre in Glasgow. Also love her as Molly Hooper in Sherlock. Next up is Selena Gomez. I loved her as Dot in The Fundamentals of Caring which is a Netflix original movie. Go watch it, it's brilliant. I also loved her in Wizardly, <laughs> Wizards of Waverly Place as Alex Russo and also in Behaving Badly as Nina Pennington. Next up is Lucy Hale who I love as Aria Montgomery in uh, Pretty Little Liars. She was also really good in another, uh, A Cinderella Story Once Upon a Song. Lucy Hale is just amazing. She's so good. She's also really good in Scream 4. Uh, also uh, an honourable mention to Joanne Foggart who I love as Anna Bates in Downton Abbey. But she was also in True Love as well and she starred alongside David Tennant in his episode and also a final honourable mention to Billy Piper who I loved as Rhoda Tyler in Doctor Who but I also loved her in Secret Diary of a Cold Girl. She's also in Penny Dreadful alongside Eva Green which I've yet to see. In at number one, right, you probably are trying to think of names of people. I found it really hard to pick a number one for this list but I ended up I couldn't not pick this woman. She is amazing. It is Sheridan Smith. I loved her as Scylla Black in Scylla, which was a three episode ITV series, which was actually put out before Scylla Black passed away last year. Sheridan was amazing. She hit all the high notes. She hit all the songs. She just made Scylla Black come out to the screen and you just totally believed everything she was doing and everything she was saying. I just recently saw her on the West End at Savoy Theatre and as um, 
in Funny Girl, which was amazing. So it was such, such a good show. And Sheridan Smith is amazing. She's also been in Gavin and Stacey. And she also did a show called The C Word. And it's honestly like, it's a testament to Sheridan Smith that she can go from being this funny character playing James Corden's sister in Gavin and Stacey to being um, a cancer patient in The C Word. It's, it's, she's absolutely incredible. So that's it. That is my top five actresses. I hope you enjoyed this. Catch me on Thursday for my Macbeth playlist. I'll see you then. Bye.